I'd like to know what you feel uh, as far as the responsibilities of representing mankind on this trip. That's uh, relatively difficult to, to answer. Uh, it's a job that we collectively said that was possible and we could do and, and of course that the nation itself is backing us. I took my family to see an extraordinary movie at the local IMAX screen last night which was actually not that local. We traveled a great distance to go and see this but it was worth it. Apollo 11 is uh, playing in IMAX screens all over the place right now probably just for a limited time. It's a documentary, don't fall asleep, it's a documentary about the incredible event of putting human beings on the moon for the very first time. The enormity of this event is something that only history will be able to judge. What we get out of this two-hour film, we get little snapshots of each of the three astronauts. You got Michael Collins, who stayed in the uh, orbiting craft above the moon, actually didn't walk on the moon, but Buzz Aldrin and Neil Armstrong did walk on the moon. We get little snapshots of what their life is like, just in quick cutaways. There's no narration in this movie, and for the most part, it's all just about rolling the launch pad into place and setting that Saturn V rocket out into space and then we get all of these extraordinary camera angles as parts of the rockets fall away as they're supposed to. It freaked my daughter out though. She was watching it. She couldn't believe like giant explosions and parts of the rocket just flying off and flying away from the spacecraft and it just gets smaller and smaller and smaller. And it's just an amazing trip. You really do feel like you're on the ride with the astronauts. All of the footage is shot on cameras that were the highest technology that they had at the time, which really does stand the test of time. So there's a lot of 70 millimeter footage in here, a lot of intimate shots of people looking at screens and listening on phones and clasping their ears and keeping their fingers crossed and lots of panning shots of all the people that showed up on launch day to observe from grandstands and they've shots of Nixon placing phone calls and being on the aircraft carrier when they're retrieving the capsule after splashdown. And of course, the money shots are the shots on the moon with the astronauts walking around and picking up grains of sand and rocks and kibitzing and talking to each other and because there's no narration you're just sort of having little glimpses of all of these famous voices all of the radio chatter that we've heard many many times but you know there's a little bit of newscaster stuff in there but for the most part you're hearing the people in the command center and you're hearing the astronauts go back and forth trying to make sense of this feat that still, I think to this day, is the grandest thing that human beings have been able to accomplish. We went to a different world, you know? We actually walked around out there. This documentary is peerless. It's really a terrific way to honor all of the people that worked so hard to accomplish the impossible. And through the observance of this and through the you know, recognition of these feats, you understand what we are capable of you know when we work together through a unification of ideas and chasing dreams and that's why watching movies about uh, and documentaries about the space race and about these missions to the unknown is so important still in 2019 we had this flurry of missions to the moon and then they just stopped doing that and now we're talking about mars and how important space travel is going to be for the future of our species and for future industries and for preservation of our planet here so it's important to kind of sit down and soak up the fact that these people went to the moon with technology that's less advanced than the foam that's in your pocket and they did it and it's an astounding piece of work the feat is worth celebrating forever for all time but this movie is also worth celebrating because it's so expertly put together we just sincerely hope that we measure up to that i guarantee you'll just be sitting back blown away by what humanity accomplished here apollo 11 extraordinary 10 out of 10.